You still have to die, but I got your sentence suspended. I'll just explain from the top. This is the same kind of thing as the cursed object you ate. There are 20 of these in total. We possess six of them. We can't destroy them. The curse is that powerful. That's where you come in. When you die, the Sukuna inside you will die as well. So here's what I propose to them. Since they've already decided to execute you, why not wait until after you've absorbed all of Sukuna to do it? So now, you have two options before you. You can die, here and now, or gather all the parts of Sukuna, absorb them, and then die. You're a strong kid, so try to help others. When you die, you should be surrounded by people. Who passed away? My grandpa, although he was more like a father to me. I see. Sorry it had to happen at a time like this. So, have you decided what you want to do? Are casualties like these from curses pretty common? This one was a rather exceptional case. But in terms of damage, it happens all the time. If all the parts of Sukuna were gone, would it really help? Would there be fewer people getting harmed by curses? Yes, of course. Hmm. So have you got that finger? Here. Looking at it again here in broad daylight, it's pretty disgusting. Okay, that's the second one. One-tenth of the whole. I wonder what's going to happen. Oh, so gross. I mean, it's so gross, it's funny. There. It's not just a physical tolerance that he has. He can fight off Sukuna's attempts to take over. We haven't seen someone with talent like this in a thousand years. What's wrong? No, no, nothing at all. <laughs> I take it this means you've made up your mind? Chosen your fate? Not at all. I still don't understand why I have to be executed. But I know I can't just do nothing. Oh, that last request of yours is going to be a pain in the ass. I'll eat every part of Sukuna. After that, I don't care. As far as how I'm going to die, I've already decided. My guy. I love finding guys like you. A fun time in hell awaits. Now, let's head out. Anyway, you're about to have an interview with the principal. Screw this up, and he can turn you down for admission, just like that. What's this? So you're not the boss? Any hierarchy other than strength is worthless. I do owe you a big favor, though. Once I make this punk's body my own, you'll be the first one I kill. It's my honor to be targeted by Sukuna himself. This guy is really that famous? Ryomen Sukuna is an imaginary fierce god with four arms and two faces. 
In the golden age of Jujutsu, sorcerers gathered all their might to challenge him and failed. Without a doubt, he is the king of curses. You're late, Satoru. Principal Masamichi Yaga. Yuji Itadori! This is an honor! What are you here for? An interview? But why Jujutsu High? To learn Jujutsu? I mean beyond that. What do you hope to find once you've studied curses and learned the art of exercising them? It was my grandfather's dying request of me. I just want to save who I can. Dying wish? You're saying you'll fight curses just because someone else told you to do that? Insufficient. That's not a doll. It's alive! In a way, they're corpses. Dolls that I've infused with my curse. A person's true nature reveals itself during a crisis. I'll keep attacking you until I get an acceptable answer. Look, man, it wasn't just someone else. It was my grandfather's dying request! Uh, the light! What the? Where is it? Family's still just someone else. A jujutsu sorcerer constantly faces death. And not just their own death. Sometimes you must ignore the victims and rend the flesh from those who the curse is murdered. It's an unpleasant job. You do this because someone else told you to? Don't make me laugh! Oh, screw you! I... Are you going to blame your poor grandfather when you get killed by a curse too? It's not easy to imagine how you feel on the verge of death. However, I can say one thing for certain. At the rate you're going, you might end up cursing your beloved grandfather for his dying wish. Jujutsu sorcerers never die without regret. So I'll ask you just once more. Why have you come here to Jujutsu High? As a kid, I was always better than most in sports and in fights. But never once did I think, this is something only I can do. Never. Consuming Sukuna is something only I can do. So even if I could escape my death sentence and run away from this responsibility, then someday I'd be eating food, taking a bath, or reading manga. And the moment I stopped to think, I'd go, oh, I bet that right now somewhere out there, someone is dying because of Sukuna. But that doesn't concern me. It's certainly not my fault. You expect me to tell myself that? Well, I refuse to do that. I don't know how I'll feel when I'm dying. But I won't regret the way I lived. Satoru, show him to his door. You're admitted. Welcome to Jujutsu High. You know, there's no real reason for you to go fight at all. Fushiguro and I could retrieve Sukuna's fingers. I said I'd do it and I will! Yeah, but you wouldn't have refused to fight. I already knew that. Huh? That was a test? If the fingers were that easy to find, don't you think we'd have collected them already? The Sukuna within you will try to regain his power, and that will lead us to the fingers. You're both vessel and locator. 
We won't get very far without you. You're next door. Hey, hey, Fushiguro! Wow, you look all better now. And together, we're heading out tomorrow! We're going to go pick up the third and final first year. Now, which mission should we go on? Let's head out! Is this good? Let's win! Why are we meeting up here in Harajuku? Because that's what she asked for. Wait, she's the one we have to go and talk to? This is real embarrassing. Yeah, so are you. Hey, we're over here! Right, I'd like you to meet... Nobara Kugisaki. You should be honored, boys. I'm your group's girl. I think I'll go in, too. Don't push yourself. You're still recovering, you know? The one we're testing this time around is no bar. What a pain in my ass. I come all the way to Tokyo and I still have to deal with dumb curses? Let's save some time. You and I should split up. Hold on a minute. Let's take this seriously. Curses are dangerous, you know. I don't want to hear it from someone who last week was a clueless normie! Now get moving! You're an out-of-control roller coaster of emotions today! Do you need a receipt? It's a curse! <laughs> I'll flat! <sweat. laughs> First strike! <laughs> My curse of energy I'm sensing, isn't it? You remember how it felt! Last away! I have a wide open shot! Going out front! Last away! A wide open shot! Blast away! Look out front! I remember how it felt! Snap in the head! Blast away! Shot! Save it with me! Black flat! Black flat! Piece of cake! Cheesy! Mm-hmm. Have I got moves or what? <laughs> that Yuji. <laughs> Some screws are loose. He's fearless. These things take the form of terrifying creatures and try to kill him. Yet, the guy has no hesitation at all. By now, you've seen plenty of Jujutsu sorcerers, some talented. And you've seen them give up because they couldn't conquer their fear or disgust, right? So today is about seeing if she's crazy enough for this.